Hey guys, welcome to our channel. In today's video, I will show you how to add age verification box to your WordPress website. Plugins for WP. WordPress premium plugins and themes for an affordable price. So we can do it by using a plugin. And in this tutorial, we will use a plugin called Age Checker. You can find it here uh, in Code Canyon. You can pay the full price $18 or you can get it from us, the exact same plugin for only $4.99. Whatever you choose is good for, uh, with us. Uh, after you download the, the plugin, just navigate to your WordPress website into plugins, add new, upload plugin, and upload the plugin uh, that you just downloaded either from us or from Code Canyon and click on install. Once you install it, click on activate. Once activated, navigate to the new age checker option here from the left side. You can see two screens, the one on the left display what it is and the one on the right giving you multiple options to design the age verification box. So let's start with the general uh, options. There are many options to go through. Let's start with the first one. Right now the box will not be displayed unless you will change it to yes. Here you can uh, change the minimum age from 18 to any other age like 21. Here you have the option to change how to let the users verify their age. Right now it's set for them to enter their birthday. You can change it to checkbox or let them enter manually their age. If you decide to change any of the options you will need to change it first and then click on the save changes in order to see the result. I will switch it back to the birthday option and then I will click on save changes once again, just like so. The cookie life box is set to 10 days, which means after submitting their age, the visitors will not see the box for another 10 days. However, we can change it to 30 days so it won't be nagging at all. Another option that is good to be familiar with is this exit button. And right now it's set to no, which means the visitor will must verify their age in order to view the content. If you want to give them an exit button so they can close the pop-up without verifying the age, you can switch it to yes. Let's move on to the next tab, the restricted sections. And here it's set to be displayed on every page. However, you can change it to display on every page, exclude uh, some pages, or you can change it to display it on only specific pages such as home page, cart, etc. I would like to display this box on every page so I will change it back to everywhere. Let's move on to the next tab. And in the styling tab we can change the visibility of the box. So first of all let's add an icon. We'll choose one from our library. Let's say this one and we can see that it was added to uh, the box after we save the, save the changes. And we can also change the width of the logo the background, a color, image, etc. For example, I will switch it to image and I will choose a different image instead of the background color. Let's go with this one. And after I will save the changes, I can see the background image over here. I can also change the opacity uh, by sliding left or right this slider over here. Right now, I will decrease the opacity, which means I will see it less, just like so. And let's move on to the next tab, which is the form text. Here we can change all the text that we have in our box. For example, we can change the title from confirm your age to anything else, something like are you over 18 years old or whatever you guys would like to write over there. Just make sure to save the changes and you will see it uh, live over here on the box on the left. So you can pretty much change whatever you want. And the last one that I would like to show you is the response text and that's the feedback the visitor will get after submitting the age if they are not 18 they will tell them that they are not in the right proper age all right so after we finish set up the box and we are satisfied let's just make it live let's expand the general tab once again and we'll change the plugin active to yes and we'll save the changes and now we can test the box we'll go from an incognito window to our website and we can see the age verification box in front of us immediately as the page load and now we'll need to verify our age. So first of all, let's fail the test. We'll uh, enter a date that is not 18 years old and we can see that we get this feedback. However, when I change it to the 18 years old after submit, I can see the content of the website in front of us. So the box is working as it should. Before wrapping things up, I would like to show you how to get any premium WordPress plugin or theme 
for 97% of the original price. Just go to pluginsforwp.com and click on the download free in order to download our free plugin manager that we developed. After you download it, go back to your WordPress website into plugins, add new, upload plugin, and over here choose and upload the plugin that you just downloaded from us. Click install and then activate the plugin. Then go to the new plugins for WP tab that was added to your WordPress sidebar. Browse between the thousands plugins and themes that we are offering. If you are looking for a specific one, type it over here and the results will appear in front of you. Browse the search results and find the item that you were looking for. When you found it, just click on purchase. You will be redirected to our cart where you can purchase this plugin for only $4.99, which is 97% of the original price. If you are looking to get multiple items, consider getting one of our unlimited downloads plans and enjoy unlimited downloads for only $12.97 a month or $87 a year.